Welcome to another one of our Bluebeam Me Up How To Tutorials, brought to you by Brighter Graphics Limited, where we show you how to maximize the potential of your investment in Bluebeam Review. Brighter Graphics are the oldest established Bluebeam partner and your premium Bluebeam solutions provider. Let's get started. In this video, we are going to show you how to use the Properties panel in Bluebeam Review. The Properties panel shows metadata about the active PDF as well as any files attached to it. If a markup, measurement, or other such annotation is selected, the Properties panel will show properties specific to that element instead. When no markup, measurement, or other such annotation is selected, the properties of the active PDF are shown in the Properties panel. File Attachments The File Attachments section lists any attachments saved in the current document. Click a file to select it, then use the tools in the File Attachments toolbar to open, save, or delete it. You can also double-click a file name to open it. The File Attachments tool contains the following options. Open. Opens the selected file. Save. Saves a copy of the selected file locally, outside of the document it's attached to. Add new. Adds a file from a local or network drive to the current document as an attachment. Delete. Removes the selected attached file from the document. File properties. Shows several standard metadata fields for the current PDF. These fields can be edited. The Tags section shows any tags currently placed on the page. These are not editable and are shown for information purposes only. The Custom Properties section contains custom metadata fields. These fields can be edited, and new fields can be added. To add a new field, click an empty cell in the Name column, type a name for the property, then click in the corresponding value column cell and add the value. To delete a custom row, click in either cell and press Delete. When a markup, measurement, or other such annotation is selected, the Properties panel shows data and parameters specific to it. Some of these parameters, found in the General section of the Properties panel, are universal to nearly all annotations. Others vary according to the type of annotation. The General section of the Properties panel contains the following. Author. Records the creator of the markup. Useful for tracking responsibility. Subject. Records a subject associated with the markup. Often used to define the category of the takeoff. Label. Generally found only in measurements, labels can be shown in the takeoff itself. Often a short code that corresponds to a particular material. Comments. This previews the markup caption. It will update automatically as the caption or caption style, defined in the appearance section, is changed. Lock. When selected, prevents accidental moving or resizing of an annotation. Appearance. This section contains settings pertaining to the display style of the markup. Custom. This section contains data pertaining to any custom columns used in the markups list. If no custom columns are currently in use, this section will not appear. Layout. This section reports where the annotation exists on the document page. Enter values to place markups precisely. If you move a markup by clicking and dragging, the change is reflected here. Options, this section will also vary from annotation to annotation. But generally, holds a quick menu to allow adding the current tool to my tools or another tool set in your tool chest and a button to make the current settings the default for that tool. Thank you for watching. We hope you found the video useful. You can visit our website, www.brightergraphics.com, for more videos in the how-to series and all things Bluebeam Review. We at Brighter Graphics, welcome your feedback to help us to improve. 